Let's journey on. How many troops do we have in the field anyway? Could have more. Um. Wow, my phone's just gone a little bit crazy. Uh, we wish to get in bed with the criminals. I can live with the church disapproving. Why are we sitting here? Why are we going there? I mean, I'm not up for something like that. Stand our troops down. Get a new army going. The trade posts down here are the absolute worst position. They constantly get attacked by everything. It's just, that's just bad. We're no longer greedy. One of our grandsons died of and so we have survived grandsons already. This is this is an old man. By any standard that we have for Crusader Kings, this is an old, old man. Look at him. He's, he's fantastic. He's a scholar crusader. Strong is he. One of the saints went to heaven. An inspiration to us all. Or 95 men will be the spearhead to thrust into the heart of the enemy. We're still hunting that bear though. And this death blob, it just does not die. I mean, they could say the say about, uh, same about us, right? We just constantly raise new troops as well. We never go away. Frederick the Hunter. Why is he dead? He died like a hundred years ago. Okay, let's resurrect Frederick the Hunter. Let's resurrect this man. It was Ketil the Hunter. This is not Frederick the Hunter. The game is kind of confusing. It's historical hunters. Now, don't you dare bam 100 gold okay we are not oh no there, there's a death blob moving about again I don't think between all the crusading armies there is even enough troops for this I mean, it, 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 it says there are, but there really aren't. Always cautiously optimistic that the death blob might go elsewhere, but they're definitely coming for us. Always. Death blobs tend to hunt the player. Could try and siege a little bit down here. But again, they're, they're taking a very precarious route. I don't, I don't like this, where they're going. Or chaplain. Sure. I judge. Oh, good boy schooler. And this hunter man can be our main commander. 
Uh, I don't, I don't like the trajectory here. This looks a little bit. Uh, I don't, I don't like it. It's January now. Hey, uh, look at them! How they, how they kind of sniff, trying to follow us. Oh no. Turning around again. <gasps> a small army is going north. Just a thousand, but these are probably turning right around. Going around here. Let's see. Let's see. What can we do? Can we do something? Come on, arrive in time. Help your allies. Yes, just in time. We have defeated an army. Oh, would you look at that? That is something. Actually did it. We just need to keep moving before this thing comes up. Crazy how just 5,000 can be such a force. Oh no, my friend. Prison. What a terrible, terrible thing to happen to you. They're coming still, they're coming. Drums in the deep. I can hear them. I mean, the Christian world has been... How long has this been going on for? When did this start? This has been going on for almost 10 years now. And the papacy has contributed zero. Which isn't even true. But close to zero, because their armies just melted. They didn't even fight or anything. They just melted. Literally, they just went there and then they went into the snow and then the snow ate them. That's what's to be expected out here. Okay, they're sieging there for a bit, so we have a chance to siege as well. Could try and follow this army. But I don't feel very good about that. Oh, no, 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 they're moving again. Means we also get moving. No, no. Stop plotting weird routes. This is where we want to go. My wife? No, my granddaughter. Huh. Then killing. Look, she's, she's just got a little pot over fire. What is this as a sigil? That's great. Let's get away from here. The death blob is blobbing again. I don't want to be caught between two blobs. Who are you? Away, oh, Swedish revolt. I don't know you. Why are we not at war with the Swedish revolt? Oh, we are. There we go. What to do? We could involve our retinue again, but we're not going to muster enough troops to really make a difference here. And our little move here might cost us our life. They're just force sieging stuff back now. Let's siege against this revolt here. While we try and figure out what to do. I mean, mercenaries are clearly the way to go, but... We could get the Knights Templar, that would be cool. How much 
much do we earn? 15. So we could get a decent group of mercenaries. I believe cavalry would be the right thing here. Probably against the light infantry. Something light, like the Pecheng Ban, that's probably good. But they are really expensive, monthly upkeep. But those should do the trick. We clean up here. We can also wait for more attrition, but they can also re-raise new armies. Oh, get a technology. We are getting in on that business. Um, right. What do we need to upgrade things? We can upgrade these to its fullest to their fullest potential. What can we do here? City walls needs improved keeps. What does another guild hall cost us? The next one. That. Not sure, but I don't really have the money to upgrade it anyway because we're investing in our palace, aren't we? Into this and that. So we can just check what this does. Castle Town. Proved keeps. Port number four. I mean, construction would probably not be the worst. Shipbuilding, we don't need that. Cities and temples, probably not the worst idea. Especially since it increases city tax. So let's bring this up, shall we? Why not? Might be the wrong decision down the road, but... Uh, there's so much more road. Where's the blob? Over here. Where is the blob? Must be here, hidden behind this. Yeah, there it is. We don't like our granddaughter, apparently. Who are we trying to kill? Pretty boy. You're already called the evil. Why do I need to pay you to do evil stuff? Come on now. Be silly. I would love to just join them there, but it wouldn't make a difference. We would just burn the 3,000 that we have. And now we need to turn around immediately because these guys are probably going to engage with us. A damn well going to try. Nope, not trying. Going somewhere north there. I mean, down there is a decent sized army to sit next to. Try that. Still hunting for that bear. Okay, there is a bottle. I mean, we're old anyway. Let's make sure that our succession is secured. We have to keep spending money on you. All right, sell it to me. It feels good, the potion. So my intention is to potentially reinforce here. But it will still be like 5,600 against 8,000. That's not enough. I 
Okay, these guys just dropped out of the war. Which means we could go here. Attack into an unfavorable position, but attack regardless. They are immediately turning back around and they're going to rush us for this. Oh no, we just caught a little bit of, it, of an army. So that's fine. Let's run away. <laughs> for the blob. For the blob re reappears. I don't want the blob. I'm scared of the blob. Blob is our nemesis. Sit here for a bit. Crusade around. Come on, holy orders. Form. Become things. We are in a pit. Should we go with the Pesheng? Let's go with the Pesheng. See how they change our fortunes. Cost us a whole bunch, but maybe. No, thank you. Are you kidding? I don't have that kind of money. Hey. Okay. I wonder, should I run away or not? I should probably run away. Start running away. Good idea. Yeah. Following us. We ran away just in time. Uh, we should probably keep running away a little bit further. <laughs> to pick up some more men. Come on, let's run into each other. How about that? Let's see what the horses do. What that horse horse do though? Forest, forest, forest. Forest, forest. Go we'll sit here and just have him come to us, maybe. Definitely want to defend against this. The grandson is dead. Uh, all the other crusaders is running away, though. They're mainly in the south. Let's go south. Attacking them. There are some... Again? How much money do I have to spend on this? Oh, this guy is in hiding. And this guy is the one going away. Let's go. Now, let's finish the siege and then we go north. No. We want to help these. This is our best and only chance ever. Oh no. Oh no 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 no. No, I, uh, damn it. I thought he would get the whole thing, but he didn't. And now we abandon our siege midway, and that wasn't a good idea. Ah. Ay ay ay. Well, there's another 3,000, because why not? Like, why shouldn't they have more? Yeah, what do I care about my reputation? I'm old. I'm a death's door. Oh, 
Where are my crusaders at? Come on, boys and girls, join up. Well, they have a 10,000 death blob again. Against our very, very petty not 10,000 death blob. We didn't even get to try the Pasheng. They want. Uh, no. No. We have one victory in this siege here. What power yes so he has the luxury of having several very disjointed armies he can pick off we do not have the same luxury because he has one big army and he keeps it together that is why we are dealing so well with all this how am i still alive and how are these all still alive? Okay, we can't take out some money again. Don't need all this. Who else is next? I mean this guy clearly, but he's running. Rather, he's hiding. He might be doing both. I can't see him right now, so I do not know if he's running while he's in hiding. And yes, I came up with this joke all on my own. What? How? Goodness. Getting a break. Where is the death blob? It's probably down here. Or over there. So in the meantime, the leader of the enemy has changed. Which is good stuff. And there's a whole bunch of troops attached to my retinue, which is just standing there. Where's the death blob, eh? All their support seems to be waning. Someone is grilling. That's nice. I don't want to stand down my mercenaries. I mean, they haven't done anything. Anything whatsoever. Oh no, we are stressed now. Death will come knocking soon. I know it. There! Look at the death blob! I found it! Still exists. Following the French not so death blobby blob. I don't want some peddlers at home. No, thank you. No, sir. Or ma'am. I mean, now we get a bunch of sieges done, since the death blob is no longer here to scatter us like chaff before the wind. But they will return soon enough. I see a ship, which is probably bringing troops from one place to another. 
What's picking up troops? Be able to tell. We've captured the target of the crusade. Very good indeed. This French army and this other army. What? Come on now. I will have to stand down the retinue eventually. They, they're ruining me. A son to our son, our grandson. Good, we could make our great grandson the ruler here. Let's give him an educator. And his educator will be I. How is this man still alive? Stressed drunkard. Okay, we should probably go south here and try and engage with all those armies. Present. Uh, but we're not going to arrive in time, I do believe. So we're just going to go here, sit on the 700 something as the death blob attacks us here. No, it is not. We'll just attack now. Oh no. They are getting the defensive position now. Oh goodness. Let us uh, fail a little bit. It's not going to go well. Even with our horses. Oh no. This time we get diarrhea. Okay, we are being destroyed as is tradition up here in the north. But we're getting a bunch through occupation now. Yeah, why didn't you join us? I really don't get how these completely light infantry troops armies are beating the heavy infantry and the cavalry. I d d beyond me. Beyond me. Okay, uh, let's stand these down. Uh, we can afford them right now. But once we raise more of our own troops, we will not be able to afford them anymore. Love to see. Okay, so we stand down the 600 we got left here. Raise these guys. Let's split these in half. And stand down the smaller army. So they cost us less. Can we afford this? Barely. We are bringing in our own retinue again. I feel like at least in a defensive battle we might have a chance. Might. Operative word being might. Look at that, there's a 7,000 army running around, existing. Not doing anything. Okay, let's get organized here. Um, what are you doing? Why are you throwing away your lives? Why? We have to link up with this one up there. attrition do we get not much and afford this that's good right, one less guys still hiding other guys I don't care about I right, will keep plotting to kill I know he's in hiding so we're not going to get him but we will plot regardless so there's the death blob. 
Probably coming up to us now. What is this here? Forest in severe winter. There are 800 joining us. Well, they might be moving on immediately. Yeah, everyone is moving. So we should move as well. I don't wish to be the only thing standing there when they arrive. I am tempted to join this because if they win they're going to get the defensive bonus but there's nothing else coming in I mean these are coming in potentially let's go there let's see don't run away don't run away now please please survive until we can join please survive for once hold out brethren yes okay we got the defensive bonus and we have some reinforcements coming I believe God, we're still losing hard. What are you doing? Join us! Oh, no. I, I am... I, I am too scared to look. Okay, we'll look. Oh no, they got reinforcements. But we have reinforcements coming too. Oh, Come on, hold out, boys. Ketiel, you can do it. Now, he didn't do it. And we lose again. How are they doing this? How are they constantly winning? I am. I am at a loss. At an utter and complete loss. They're so good. It's so good. Keep losing my troops. Every time I think we have the advantage, it just completely gets thrown into my face. Finally, that guy's dead. Oh, and we get a new one who's even worse. Okay. And on these again, bring them up. Now contribution isn't even going up. I mean it is. We're at 20%, 5% more than we had before. I mean it's still somewhat winning. <laughs> somewhat. Can we get more mercenaries? Oh a holy order. Yes! Yes, give us the holy yes, okay, this this gives us this gives us a fighting chance. This gives us a fighting chance. Okay, finally we have control over a sizable army. This gives yeah, this 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 makes things a little bit different. Um <laughs> That's a lot of money, man. Sorry. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Let's do this. Let's go get some decent commanders from the world. An inspiring leader. Ooh, unyielding heavy infantry. We'll pull out all the stops now.
pay. Can I now finally take some money out of this campaign? Without someone jumping in immediately. Can we do this now? Thank you. Which also means we can upgrade our little palace. Which we will very much like to do. Okay, all our new commanders are coming in. You get replaced. And you get replaced. You get replaced. And you become this. And you're already something, so you come here. And you lead this. Lead this. Lead these. Can't put them to task, okay. What? Which one? Art thou joking? How am I still? I should stop questioning why I'm still alive. I just, just, I should just accept my good fortune for once. Okay, we're catching a piece of his army for once. And there's a big blob, a big second Christian blob. Okay, I think, I think this is going to be it. This is going to be it. Where is he going? Okay, come on my Christian brothers. Yeah, yeah, I know. Everyone knows I'm a killer. I've been doing this for the better part of a decade, of a century. Even a decade. Okay. So we will go on the offensive with a 28 commander. And if this guy loses his center, I will lose my center. Rest assured. And finally we have done it. Finally we have overcome. Did we kill them all, or are they running? I think we actually got them. I think we finally destroyed the p the heathen army. After... My goodness, 15 years of war. We have challenged and won against the heathens. Let's, I want to get this big army here. Oh, would you look at that? Goodbye, patrician. Hello, new patrician. Yes, it is our own failure. Let us be humble about it. And another big battle for us. Let's see how it turns out. One flank of the enemy is broken. A second flank has been dealt with. Our center, despite being well equipped, we did it. We have done it. God has granted Prince Mayer Botsane of Finland victory in the Crusade for Finland. Miomo Markkonen has been beaten at every turn through the war. <laughs> no. And he has finally had to give up his holdings in Finland. Prince Mayer Botstein has granted the new lands of Finland to Botstein Stenkirka. The Pope has made an announcement about the victory in virtues. Praise God. So at the age of 81, we become king 
great great king bot stain. Let's stand down the things we don't want. Go away. Go away. And bring these home and stand them down. I still want my capital to be here. Are you joking? Yes, this is our cap. And our crown focus. Scotland. Why would I want my capital here? Are you are you crazy? Okay, let's check this out, right? I think we only own this piece. So we could give this city to one of our sons or something. If there's even still one alive. Faster bot stain. But he has an, no children. He has no children either. Why do you guys not have children? You have no. I don't want to give it to my grandson. You only have bastards. Well done, girl. We give it to our grandson. Grand city of Erstebotten. Why not? My grandson. Why do you not want to be at our court? I could give you an artifact, maybe. Swedish Crusader Flachion. No, definitely not. Could give you the arm of a saint, he's going to like that, but it's probably not going to be enough to convince him to come here. So we might have to kill this kid. I mean, do I really care about this land all that much? Not really. But we got it, so that's cool. <laughs> right? I mean, we actually won this. And look at all the money we got out of it too. That is an insane amount of gold. We have fulfilled the ambition to create a treasury, all I'll say. Um, let's see, what ambitions do we have still? We could found a bloodline. We are not going to be able to do that. Except for maybe... Murder and execute 30 people. We're close to that. Let's check our dungeon. We will execute him. We just need to murder one more person, which we're already pretty decent at. And we've been doing this for a while now. Court physician. And it, oh, we have more stuff over here, apparently. And we can turn this into a duchy. Um, sure, let us create this duchy here. Am I going to give it to this guy? <laughs> yeah. Get this. And what's up here? I think that's one of our other duchy titles now. The Republic of Österbotten. Yeah, that's okay. I'm not so sure what this is, but... Take care of it, eventually. Now we have Finland. Through a crusade. A long and arduous battle. Bring our troops home. And there is a children's crusade. Such a wild imagination even for a child. Well, this was fantastic. Uh, it did bring us way, way, way ahead. Primarily because we now have a boatload of money. Which is basically all we need to finish up our little goals here. So we could check out the trade zones. Let's see. 
So most of these are always still, and why not expand a little bit further south here? The building on the coast of Kent, because we can now. We actually have the money for it. So we get the Strait of Dover as well. A little bit of full toll there. Some more income. And we need to completely control the Duchy of Gotland, which I think I do have a minimum of 20 cities in our realm, which we... not yet. Uh, total number of trade posts. That's still going to take a while. Ah, oh, it's going to take a while. But if we create more republics, such as the one that our great-grandson is leading... Oh, he's a tribal. He's not a republic. Can I help you make this into a city? Yeah, we can try. Let's try and make this into a city. Could build another city here as well. Let's build ourselves another city. Yeah. Well, thanks for watching. This was very intense. The last two episodes, actually. Quite enjoyed this. And we have broken free without having to fight a war over breaking free because well you can't be a king while you're underneath the thing uh, underneath a king, can you? So that's pretty neat. <laughs> Most serene Republic of Finland. Republic of Gotland. Still ours. Good stuff.